Do you guys ever wonder who the best NFL running back is right now? Well, I'm here to tell you about Saquon Barkley, who is the best running back in the NFL right now. So we'll be learning about Saquon's family and childhood, and then also his college career at Penn State, and then his NFL career so far. So according to NFL Therapy, Saquon Barkley was born in the Bronx in New York. He was raised by his dad, Ollie Barkley, and his mom, Tanya Barkley. He also has two brothers, two sisters. His oldest brother, Ollie Jr., got, was the one who got him into football. Because if Saquon Barkley didn't get into football, his family runs is a big boxing family, so he would have been a pro boxer, he says. So at a young age, his older brother got him into football, and he fell in love with it. He, he always admired the New York Jets' running back, Curtis Martin, and he always dreamed of playing in MetLife Stadium. And then uh, we'll be go or next we have uh, we're going over his college career at Penn State. So in 2015, Saquon Barkley committed to the University of Penn State to play running back. His his freshman season went ha exactly how he would like it to go. He set a bunch of records at Penn State for scoring the most touchdowns as a freshman and receiving or not receiving all purpose yards as a freshman as well. He had, uh, he had many awards, one being Big Ten Freshman of the Year in 2015. Also, uh, an, uh, first team All Big Ten as well. Now, in his sophomore season, he had a great season as well, setting uh, a n numerous records as well, setting all-time rushing yards in a season at Penn State, and then also uh, most receiving yards by a running back at Penn State. His junior year, he led he led Penn State to being ranked number fourth at one point, but then they lost a, a close game to Michigan in 2017. Although you're supposed to spend four years in college, most people do, but Saquon uh, decided to leave Penn State and enter into the NFL draft in 20, 2018, where then he was drafted fourth overall by the New York Jets, and this this was a, a dream come true for Saquon. He dreamed of playing in MetLife Stadium because of he was a big fan of the New York Jets when he was younger, and uh, uh, the his rookie season went how everyone expected it to go. He he won Rookie of the Year, led all rookies in rushing yards and touchdowns, and uh, it was a great season. He won Rookie of the Year back to back with uh, another New York Giants rookie wide receiver the year before Odell Beckham Jr. But his sophomore season in the NFL didn't go too well. He had uh, numerous of ankle injuries to where he missed a few games and didn't put as big as numbers as he did his uh, rookie campaign. But then everyone thought he was just going to bounce back the next year and have a great season just like his rookie year. But his season ended early with an ACL injury to which led him to sit out for the rest of the 2019 season. Now, everyone was thinking Saquon Barkley was going to be a bust taking number uh, four in the draft. And he proved all the, the haters wrong. And this season, he's had uh, 1,500 all-purpose uh, all purpose yards, leading all running backs and receiving yards, and all, well, all-purpose yards, <clears throat> and his second NFL touchdowns for running backs. So now he's leading his t the New York Giants into hopefully a playoff picture spot in this year's uh, playoffs. And, yeah. So today we went over Saquon Barkley's childhood and then uh, his college career at Penn State and then now his NFL career that is still going on today.